First, disconnect power and remove the battery when changing an LCD panel. Then proceed with removing six rubber screw covers to gain access to the bezel screws. Next, remove six bezel screws. It's useful to keep the sets of screws from each compartment separate from each other. Now you can remove the bezel to gain access to the LCD panel. Carefully lift it up starting from the side and move along the top and the bottom edges. Try not to apply too much force as it can fracture the bezel. Now, remove three mounting screws on each side bracket of the LCD panel. Do not confuse the mounting screws with the hinge screws. This laptop has two mounting brackets Separate the mounting brackets from the LCD panel by removing four screws from each side. Remember which bracket is left and which is right. Flip the screen over and put it on the keyboard. Disconnect the inverter cable by pulling the tape up. Then disconnect the video cable. Push at the sides to dismount, then pull it straight out, move it away from the screen. Discard the old panel. If the screen doesn't have a protective film, you can place a paper or a cloth on the keyboard to protect the screen. Place a new screen on the keyboard. Reconnect the video cable by gently pushing on the side buttons. Reconnect the inverter cable by pressing on it. Slightly peel off the tape holding the protective film on both sides and flip the screen over. Remove the protective film. Reattach the mounting brackets with the four small screws. Once the brackets are secured, replace the three mounting screws. Now replace the bezel. Start from the top edge, put the latch through the bezel notch, and gently snap around the perimeter of the display assembly. Replace the six bezel screws. And finally put on the screw covers. Place the battery back in and plug the power. Now turn the laptop on. Once the startup screen appears, the mission is accomplished.